What's going on you guys, Charlie here from MA Performance and in past videos we've covered exhaust systems on some of our more popular platforms. As we all know, your car's exhaust tone is actually what defines it on the road whether you're just cruising or you're doing a flyby. Now, today we're going to cover our top five exhausts for the ND 2016 Plus Miata, so stay tuned. Now an exhaust is gonna be one of those first mods that we do to our cars, and with a better flowing exhaust comes more horsepower. However, not all exhaust systems do sound the same, so today we're gonna to be covering our top five best-selling exhaust for the ND Miata in no particular order, so stay tuned because the fifth one might just be the one for you. The first one on our list is the Borla S-Type Axleback Exhaust. Now, the piping material is made out of a stainless steel, coming in at a price of $597. Main takeaways with this are that you're gonna get a very good tonal quality throughout the entire rev range without any droning or booming characteristics, even under deceleration. Now, it does feature a straight-through muffler with OEM-like dual-tip aesthetic to it, so kind of low profile. Now, additionally, this exhaust isn't exactly so loud that you couldn't, you know, turn up the tunes and enjoy a nice song. Now, it is lightweight at only about 16 pounds, so you're gonna be saving some weight there. But anyways, let's go ahead and jump in and see how this one sounds. <laughs> you guys now the second one on the list is maybe one of my personal favorites the HKS Legamax axle back exhaust now this one is made out of stainless steel comes in at a price of 582 and the main takeaways with this one are that it consists of 50 to 54 millimeter piping that exits out the dual 75 millimeter tips now only has a sound level of about 92 decibels while stock is 89 so it's not incredibly louder just enough more for you to hear it made of a 304 stainless steel, and it is obviously slightly lighter than the factory exhaust, but there's no rasp, drone, or boominess at all. Of course, with HKS, they have an incredible sound quality to it and build quality as well, with a little bit of a deeper tone than stock. So, enough of me talking about how it sounds. We're just gonna jump in and show you how it sounds, so let's get into it. <laughs> Now, time for number three. Number three on the list is the MagnaFlow Steel Catback Exhaust. Now, this one is made out of the 409 stainless steel. Comes at a price of 689. Now, main takeaways. Again, 409 stainless steel on this one, and it goes from a three inch to a dual two and a half inch piping. Now, it is reportedly extremely quiet and performs well. However, for those not wanting a very loud exhaust, this is probably gonna be the one for you while still maintaining decent power and performance qualities. Now it is obviously super simple to install with some basic tools and utilizes obviously all of the factory mounting points. So easy to install, doesn't necessarily make it too loud. So if you're looking for more of a gentleman's exhaust, this may be a great option for you. Without further ado, let's jump in and see how it sounds. <laughs> All right, you guys, now number four on the list, but potentially number one in your hearts is the Gretti Supreme SP Axleback. Now, this one is made out of a 304 stainless steel, comes in at a price of 660. The main takeaways for us here are that it is made of two and a half inch piping material, again, out of that 304 stainless steel and exits from dual three and a quarter inch tips. Now, it is extremely easy to install, being that it's only an Axleback. Now, it is also not, again, much louder than stock, but does give a satisfying low grumble when cruising around town and, you know, when you get on the throttle. Now, it does also come with that limited lifetime warranty from Gretti, and in our opinion, sounds absolutely phenomenal. So, shout out to the guys over there for making a great exhaust. But without further delay, let's jump in and show you how it sounds. <laughs> All right, now the fifth and final cat back on the list is the Remark Exhaust. Also, again, another one made of 304 stainless steel, comes in at a price again of 660. 
Now, main takeaways, again, two and a half inch diameter, 304 stainless steel piping, comes in two different variations, one for the automatic trans and one for the manual trans equipped car. Now, it does have removable tips, so you can finesse the positioning to your liking. Uh, it does have titanium stainless, black, chrome, carbon, and titanium cover options, so you have different looks you can go for. It does have a slightly deeper tone than the factory exhaust, and many have reported that this has no drone, even with catless headers, and definitely not tinny or raspy by any means. Now, it does also come with Remark's limited lifetime warranty, so again, you know that it's made by people who are willing to back the product they make. Always a big plus for me when I see stuff like that. So anyways, without further ado, delay, or postponing, let's jump in and show you how it sounds. <laughs> You guys, now that's gonna end it for the top five cat back slash axle back exhaust systems for the ND Miata. What do you guys think? Did we uh, maybe butcher the list? I don't know, I think we kind of nailed it if I'm being honest. These are definitely some of the top ones that I would put in my book. Uh, my maybe personal top two might have to be the HKS or Gretty ones. Maybe it's the fanboy in me, but anyways, that's where we're gonna end it. If you guys think that we should have put somebody else on the list, or you'd maybe like to see us make one of our own exhaust systems for this platform, go ahead and let us know down in the comments below. Leave us a big old thumbs up and subscribe and hit that notification bell so you don't miss any of our future uploads. Unless you hated this video, then don't do any of that stuff. If you're interested in buying one, check out the links down below, but that's where we're gonna end it. Like I've said the last three times, see you in the next video, peace.